Hi Audrey. Hello. Em, how are you doing? I'm fine, thanks. And how are you? I'm not too bad. Just to start off with, um, this is a performance review, just to cover the last six months of your work here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, did you receive the paperwork yeah, that I, I sent you? Yeah. Yes. Okay. And do you understand the process of? We're going to look at what you've done over the last six months, um, how well you've done, and where you need to improve. Then we'll look at what we need to do to make you better in the future and where the company can help you improve. Mm -hmm. Are you happy with that? Yeah, I am. Okay. All right. So to start off with, how's things with you? How are you settling in? Well, I won't, I won't say settling. How are you getting on with your job? Um, not too bad, but okay. um, not as good as I was in the medical department. Okay. And why is that, if I may ask? I was quite comfortable in the medical department. Yeah. And I knew what I was doing and I thought I was at the right place and I've been moved to where I'm more comfortable at all. I feel like I do know what I'm doing. Alright, okay. The time. Okay. Alright, so just to start off with, um how do you feel your performance has been over the last six months? Um, not not as good as it has been before when I was at the medical department. Okay, alright, so You've moved from the medical department where you've worked for the last five years in this company mm -hmm. and then over the last six, eight or so months we've moved you into the beauty department. Yeah. And how do you feel you've performed there? In the beauty department, yeah. not very good and I feel like I don't really belong there. Oh, why is that? Because I feel like um, I'm too old to be with the young girls and yeah. I'm not as confident as they are. Which okay. is probably what's making me perform not very good. Alright, okay, okay. What about your sales? And how, how has that been? Um, how do you feel you've performed sales well? Like from previously. Okay, and what's the reason behind that? Um, probably me not being as confident as I was at the medical department. Okay, alright. Is it just you yourself or is it the product or...? Um, it's, it's not really my cup of tea, so yeah. um, because it's not what I've got so much interest in. Yeah. It makes me not to perform as good as I normally did before. Okay. What if we gave you more training? Would that help? Um, probably would. Okay. Anything else? Um, I'd prefer to go back to the medical <laughs> department. Okay. All right. Okay. Don't um, mind me writing. It's just I'm taking down all your points. Okay. Okay. I feel that's where I belong. Yes. And I've performed very well over the past years when I've been there and I feel like I'm just wasting the company time being where I'm not performing very well. Okay, but you do understand that as a customer service representative, we we moved you from the medical department into the beauty department because we felt you had the, the knowledge and the experience to teach the younger ones. In, in sales and bring them up and help the company develop. I do understand, but um, it seems not to be working because my sales have gone down. I'm not performing as okay. good as I used to, but I understand the people. Okay. So, looking back at your previous performance, Audrey, over the last four or five years, you've always beaten your targets. You've always been way above the targets and you've done well. So, I'd just like to praise you on that. Very well done on that. And I hope you can improve on this last appraisal and, and achieve better in the future. How do you think uh, your, your performance has gone um, so far? Well, not good at the moment, but yeah. it used to be very, very good. Okay. When I was where I was comfortable and I felt yeah. like I knew everything and I knew how to do everything that I had to do. Okay. But this time I just feel like... Um, I'm where I don't belong, so yeah. that's why my performance has gone down. Alright, okay. So, what can we do to help you settle in the beauty department? Um, more training. Yep. And, um, uh, I could probably do with uh, someone working hand in hand with me. Okay. So, yeah, one of the... Get like a supervisor and kind and of role, okay. That would do, and um, a bonus would be nice as well. Okay. You 
you are aware about the bonuses that I'm sure you're aware of this that it works on, on achieving your targets and exceeding those targets so if you look at your performance over the last six months you haven't achieved those targets so you therefore you do not qualify for a bonus but if you improve over the next half of the year you and you beat those targets or achieve them then you do qualify for a bonus does that make sense to you yeah okay so um audrey you have mentioned that you require training you want to work with someone so in a supervisory role and you also mentioned the bonus bit about the training we can arrange for for more training as soon as you get back from your holiday so by the 3rd of november the week of the monday the 3rd of november is that a good day for you yes yeah, okay so from the 3rd of november for a whole week monday to friday um james from the training department will come and work with you and ex re-explain the products to you and will also give you some product to take home with you so that you can get to know them better okay is that fair with you yeah do you fine. feel that will help you yes uh, but i can do wednesday okay i've got a doctor's appointment on wednesday okay that's fine and it's so quite a long way so wednesday is out the yeah okay all right okay um working with the supervisor so the week after you finish with james from the training department are you happy to have a supervisor come in and check with you and clarify a few pointers here and there yes i am okay all right and also just i'll be monitoring your phone calls every now and then okay yeah just to observe how you're dealing with customers and all that stuff okay okay yeah i understand but um i've been doing very very well all the yeah. times and i got moved from the department that i was very very yeah. good with which was not my choice so i yeah. feel it, well i'm responsible for not doing very well but then it's partly not my fault because i got moved from where the company knew that i was very good at yeah. so i still feel I'm, I still should get a bonus. Alright, okay. The reason we moved you from the medical department to the beauty department was because we felt as an organisation that you performed very well in the medical department and there's proof for that and we've, we can't praise you enough for that. We feel your, your experience, your knowledge and your age as well will help bring up the younger generation in the beauty department and sort of have sort of someone to look over to. I don't know if that, that explains why we moved you. It does, but yeah. well, at the same time it didn't work like that. Yes. Yeah. Instead it just brought me down. Okay. And left me with um, not confident anymore. Alright, okay. Um, other than training and supervision and all that, is there any other issues that could have caused your performance to, to reduce? Um, I think uh, probably due to my age, I'm not so into this beauty product. Okay. So it's probably one of the reasons that's making me not perform so well. Okay. All right. Okay. We'll we'll look into that as well. But we've spoken to the the guys that you look after that you supervise, and they're very <coughs> excuse me, they're very happy with with your leadership and how you're performing as well, and they feel you brought the team together you have that team cohesion so you are doing quite well you just need to improve your targets and i'm sure you can do that with the training that we will provide and the supervision and me observing your calls and giving you tips here and there thank you very much yeah. i'll try my best do you have any other questions before we come to the end of the appraisal audrey yeah um if there any chance i could go back to the of me going back to the medical department because I feel that's where you belong and I feel like it's company it's the waste of company time and money paying me for being where I don't really do well while we all know that at the medical department I, I do much much better and it's good for the company and it's good for me as well because it gives me the passion to come to work all right okay um I feel your performing, you, your performance just needs to improve in the beauty department but I also feel that that's the right place for you once you've settled with the training and the observation and me listening into your calls I'm sure you'll do well and within six months, six months from now I'm sure we'll be looking at the different picture order so just 
give it some time and we'll keep reviewing between now and your next appraisal we'll keep reviewing how your training went how you can improve uh, by being observed and and also me reviewing your phone calls is is that okay go okay. to your training yeah. for a week with james yeah, except and then the wednesday except the wednesday yes of course then you move into the following week where you're supervised and then I'll also observe your cause and see how you're getting on and try and give you pointers to see where you can improve. Yeah. Yes. Audrey, uh, do you have any final questions before we come to the end of the appraisal? Yeah. Um, I was thinking maybe we could have um, Fridays as our trial day for, the, for our product. Okay. I think that would motivate me and the rest of the staff. Maybe we help the staff with the models. Yeah. And we try all our products on us. Alright, so not so, only getting to work on the products, but working with the products and yes. getting to know how they work. Yeah, I think all it right. motivates people like me who are not so familiar yeah. with the, our products and who don't really use our products so much. Okay. Yeah. Alright, okay. And would benefit us a lot. Okay, alright. And, and that is it, Audrey. I just want to say, well done over the last few years. I always praise you whenever we have these appraisers and you've done very well to to help this business grow and I hope over the next six months you can you can improve and work on on the points that we've picked up on and and we'll I also as your line manager work on these points of making sure you get the training the supervision and the observation to help you improve on your work so enjoy your holiday and hopefully when you come back we can improve on, on the last six months as appraiser yeah, Thank so I'll see much. you in six months' time for another appraisal. Thank you very much. Thank you.